Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video we are going to solve an example on real numbers. The question is the least number which is a perfect square and is divisible by each of 16, 20 and 24 is. So they are talking about the least number which is a perfect square. Now if we look at the options 240 is not a square number. 1600 is a square number of 40, 2400 is again not a perfect square, but 3600 is a square number of 60. So we are left with only two options to check which is the correct answer. So first just discard off the numbers which are not perfect squares and keep only the ones which are perfect squares. Now to check which out of the two is divisible by each of these numbers we go for LCM of 16, 20 and 24. So I'm going to do it separately using prime factorization. 16 has to be divided by a prime number. So 16 goes in the table of 2. 2 times 8 is 16. 2 times 4 is 8. 2 times 2 is 4 and 2 times 1 is 2. So we have got the factors of 16 as 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. Let us find out the factor of 20. So again I am going to use the prime factorization. 20 goes into table of 2. So 2 times 10 is 20. 2 times 5 is 10 and 5 1 times is 5. So the factors of 20 are 2 times 2 times 5. Now finally let us find out the factors of 24. So it can be divisible by 2. So 2 12 times. 2 6 times is 12. 2 3 times is 6 and 3 1 times is 3. So the factors of 24 are 2 times 2 times 2 times 3. Now let us find out the LCM. So for the LCM we will circle out the common numbers first. So 2 is common in all the three numbers. So we will write 2 times. Again there is one more 2 which is common in all. So we will write only once then we have two common from these two terms so we write it as two and then we are going to write the left out terms that is two times five times three so we get the lcm here as eight times ten is eighty and eighty times three is two hundred forty so after we get the lcm we have to check which one is divisible by the given lcm so it should be perfectly divisible as given in this question. So let us try with 1600 divided by 240. So 1600 divided by 240. So 10 goes from here, 10 goes from here. Both go in the table of 4. So 4, 6 times is 24 and 4, 40 times is 160. So we get it as 40 over 6 which can be again reduced by dividing it by 2. So 2 3 times is 6 and 2 20 times is 40. So we do not get a perfect divided number. So 1600 is not the right option. Now let us try to divide 3600 by 240 and see what we get the answer. So 3600 divided by 240. So 1 0 goes from here, 1 from here. These both go in the table of 6. So 6 4 times is 24 and 6 60 times is 90. So 60 over 4 we get it as 4 1 times and 4 15 times. So we get an integer here. So this is perfectly divisible. So the number the least number which is divided by all the three that is 16 20 and 24 is 3600 
So this is how we solve this example. I hope you have understood and liked the video. And thank you for watching.